Greetings my friends. Tonight's video here in the retro video shed is basically me going through and showing off most of my VHS and Beta horror collection. It is nothing of the type of like my friend Dale's collection on VHS which is absolutely amazing because that's all he collects is nothing but horror. I collect all sorts. So let's begin. Let's go around to the side here. And let's start from this corner and work our way around. And let's have a look. Okay, now this might include some science fiction horror as well. Okay, let's start with Extro. There's the original Thorny in my home video right there. The best part about this movie is actually the cover. That's it. Okay, Children of the Corn, Thorny and my Betamax. I won't be opening all my tapes up. Uh, covers up tonight. But uh, now, continuing on, we've got a bit of glare there. Suspiria, Thorny and I, Halloween 3, The Brood on Intervision from the UK. This is actually a UK release. Silent Night, Deadly Night 1 and 2. And if you're wondering why my voice is funny, it's because it's very cold. And when it gets cold, my nose clogs up. <laughs> so there you go. Right. Prophecy. Motel Hell. The re-release by Video Gems Warner Brothers. The original. Incubus. The awesome Evil Dead original release this is the real release as you can tell and here we go Let's take a look at that sucker that is beautiful just beautiful <clears throat> right the evil which I really enjoyed we've got the final terror we have the Salem's Lot 3 hour version we have Black Christmas the US release we have the Swarm, the long version. We now move along a bit further and we will find the Changeling. We have Trilogy of Terror. Great TV movie. We've got Phantasm. Got a few copies of that one. Uh, we have Tentacles, Dumbwitch Horror, Carrie, okay we have, I've also got The Haunting, I've got The Thing, The Legacy, a couple of uh, Sequels of the uh, Creature from the Black Lagoon. And Legend of Hell House. And Lake Placid. And we'll move up a bit further. And we now have It, Demon Seed, Kingdom of the Spiders. And Return of the Living Dead 1 and 2. Now up here. We've got... Cujo, Basket Case, not really a horror I'd say, Rabbit, Halloween 2, I love that, Piranha, the beautiful film pack Monster Scrub, which I just love to death, okay, Scanners, The Alchemist, which I've only watched once, the Gate, I'm still trying to get The Gate 2. Mother's Day, the original Betamax release. Death Ship. Sorry Simon, I can't let that one go I'm afraid. Uh, Phantasm, the Australian release. Night Kill. Haha, <laughs> the stuff. Ha, 
<sighs> Deadly blessing. Kiss of the tarantula is there as well. Okay, what else we got here? Let's, oh, hello. Oh, sorry, wrong one. I thought I had two copies of uh, Deadly Blessing, but I don't. Okay, moving up to the next shelf. These two right here. Blood Beach. <laughs> I love that stuff. Okay. Aha, uh -huh, yes, the excellent bells. I gave another copy to to Dom, which he loved, which is very nice. I've very, uh, anyway, I can help you guys out with, with uh, tapes, I'm happy to do. Okay, we're scrolling along here. Aha, uh -huh, here's the original release of When a Stranger Calls. I love this movie. Got a fantastic copy of Rats and Venom as well, which is slightly faded. I got uh, Venom from, for $2 from the Brickworks Market. Rats, of course, a beautiful green cover there. I think that's the only green besides this one here. It's the only, I think it's the only green uh, cover art that Roadshow did. Okay, let's keep going along here. Right, let's go down a bit. Moving on down. Ah, yes. Who could forget? Hate the way these things stick to each other when it's hot. Ugh. Creep Show 2. What a beauty. I love this release. It's fantastic. The big fat clamshells. They're bloody awesome. Just love them. Put that back in there. Yeah, what else do I have down here? I've got uh, Deep Blue Sea. I should have uh, Deep Rising somewhere around here. Now there's a few more there that you can plainly see. Scream 2. Vamp. It's not a horror film. Creepers. Palace Explosive. Carnival of Blood is another one. Dark Knight of the Scarecrow. Got Toxic Avenger Part 1, 2 and 3 in this place. There's there's the first one. One Dark Knight, Devouring Waves, which is also called Monster Shark or Devil Fish. So let's go up to the Warner Brothers releases. Check these two out. A couple of beauties. I still haven't watched these films yet actually, which is pretty sad that I haven't done that. Okay, that's the end of those. Keep going along, keep going along. What else we got here? Ah, yes. My beautiful copy of The Shining on Betamax. Isn't that glorious? That is a pretty old tape, people. Very old. So uh, it's a great. I'm really happy to have it in good, good condition like that. Get back in there, you. <laughs> okay, so there's that one. Get in there. Oh, it's so tight in here. All right, so that's those. Ah, oh, I've got two copies of the pack of the pack, which is a, which is this movie over here. There's my poster from 1977. Now, moving along once again, we have The Exorcist 2. I love that movie, actually. Most people don't like it, but I think it's good. Uh, Deadly Friend is not really a horror. Let's move along. Nightmare on Elm Street, we've got, I've got 2, 3, and 5. I may have 4 on Fox Video, I think, if I'm correct. There it is, Nightmare on Elm Street 4. What a great franchise that is. And we'll keep going along. Ah... Savage Harvest, not really a full horror, bit of a thriller action, more likely. Okay, keep cranking along. There's Poltergeist, the original MGM 
release. What a great flick that is. Okay, keep going along. There's Poltergeist 2 and 3 down here part of the, as part of the CEL collection. And there's Frenchman's Farm I bought from Blockbusters about 1996. Don't be afraid of the dark. Now this is a weird, I'm not sure how much of a horror this is really. But there's, there's some weird looking dudes. Seriously, that's that's pretty whacked. Okay. Keep going down. Aha, here we go. Got a pretty good collection of Halloweens in here. We've got the American Media release. We've got the 25 Years of Terror DVD, H20, the extended edition of Halloween. Halloween 2, 4, and 5, and 6. They're all there as well. Right. So, 11 minutes have gone by. I'll call it, uh, call it quits at this point for this video, but I'll do another one very shortly. And uh, in about half an hour, and put these up on the net for you guys to see. And uh, we'll continue on with more stuff from inside here very shortly. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Hello to Dom and Aussie Roadshow and everybody else that's out there. Um, still part of the community. We've lost a few. And I hope we can rebuild the community again. And uh, I also want to make a shout out right now though to uh, Dan and Tim. And they've got uh, VHS, I think it's VHS Hitfest. Um, I think they're in uh, Pennsylvania. There's a couple of great guys with about 5,000 VHS. I think they're all American. Maybe a few pals in there somewhere, but uh, hello to you guys, and I can't wait to uh, have my collection included in your uh, Adjust Your Tracking VHS documentary. That should be awesome. Okay, guys, got to go. Uh, lots to do, little time. And I'll catch you later.